Hello everyone, welcome back to Spiritual Lux Oracle. Thank you for your likes, your comments, and your subscribes. Thank you to everyone who has been booking personal readings and all of that, all of the things, okay? <laughs> so I'm hearing you look so good. You be making your person lose their train of thought, child, because I just lost my train of thought and Ooh, yeah, with Oscar Wilde at the bottom of the deck, you look so good that this person be like, God dang. Okay, and you know what? I'm seeing, um, it was this reel that I saw, and it was like, basically like, <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, but it's like, when you are, your person loves when you're dressed down, okay? They love when you're in your bonnet, they love when your hair is tied, no makeup on, sweatpants, they love that part of you. But it's almost like when you like get ready, when you get dressed, it's like you're a new person every time. Like it's almost like they forget like <laughs> how fire you are, how you put that shit on or how you d beat a face here. Okay. It's like you look so good to your person. And I'm hearing this song. I'm hearing a specific part. Um, I don't want to let you go ever. I don't know what you have planned to do tonight Okay, so this person is coming through to let you know that they don't want to let you go forever And I'm getting, this is a, this is, I'm getting for some of y'all, this is a 50 and up connection You could be 45 years old and up, okay, or this person could be, or it's like you could be reconnecting with someone that you used to date, reconnecting with someone that you used to know, reconnecting with someone from your past, okay, that it never really went anywhere for some of you, but it's like, it's a new spark between y'all, it's a new energy between y'all, it's a new slate for a clean foundation, it's a new slate for a new love here, because I'm, I'm getting, and hey, let's try a new thing, and let's rock a new flame. Okay, this person can have a big chain. Okay, or like like flashy jewelry for some of you. Okay, or you could. Someone could be about to get like a diamond necklace here. Okay, um, or that could just be me because I just ordered a tennis <laughs> a tennis necklace. But y'all know how energy works. Energy attracts like energy. So y'all know how I go. Okay. Speaking of y'all know how it go, I'm about to turn my comments off because it'd be a few little bad apples that don't know how it go, child, okay? So they gotta go. And it's gonna be a few little bad apples in this connection that wanna play stupid or wanna play like it's some puppy love or it's not gonna last or this like, yeah. Uh, people are, you know what? It could have been a certain energy. I'm not even going to say people. It could have been one person in your person's energy that was trying to downplay this connection. If this person would open up about how they felt about you, they would downplay it like, oh, you'll get over it. Or, um, you know, in the beginning, the, but the beginning butterflies, like, shut the fuck up. We gonna, you, this person going to have butterflies for you forever. With Hierophant here, Sacral Chakra, and hey, man, this person gets aroused just looking at you, just having them around here. This is a divine connection. This is a divine connection. And let's try a new thing. Because I'm really getting it's like y'all could have tried before. And maybe it was wrong, right person, wrong timing here. Okay. But I don't believe in that. Okay. It could have just been that y'all were supposed to trigger each other to learn more lessons before this could be a sacred union here. Okay. Because it's like, you know, both parties have to be divine in order for it to be a divine union okay let's not forget that part okay let's not forget that part okay with uranus we have sudden seismic shifts okay freedom unpredictability your person is going to start becoming unpredictable okay they're going to start being a version of themselves that they have never been with you they're going to start revealing a version of themselves or revealing feelings of themselves or revealing feelings that they have been trapped or that they have been trapping within themselves here okay it's like this person's cells are going through a rebirth at this time 
this person's cells are going through a rebirth at this time yeah hermit i cannot make this up it's like even the even the things that this person used to indulge in i cannot make this up with the devil card even the things that this person used to find fun or maybe this person used to thrive in toxicity it's like they are so bored over there they hate it there now <laughs> They hate it there now. Like, they just want to be with you. I don't want to be with you. I don't want to be with you. Everything you do is brand new. Listen, everything you do, everything you introduce this person to, it's almost like it's straight from the divine. It's like you are waking this person up. It's like you, your pussy is magic. Okay? So, y'all know we got to do the 18 plus reading. Your womb is magic. Okay? Your energy is magic. Even if this person never been inside of you. Okay, your energy is a magic. Yeah, 11th house. It's like, um, I'm hearing we don't want, we don't want to never end. Y'all could have started off as friends. Okay, y'all could have started off as friends. There could have been. And you know what? For some of y'all, y'all could have linked up because y'all have the same mission. Okay, both of y'all could be the same sign or y'all could have the same life path number, the same north node here. Okay. And it's like, you could have woke this person up from going down the wrong path, going down their south node. And it's like, now, because you have the same mission or because you have the same heart, because you have the same soul, if this is a twin flame connection, it's like you have, because because with the everything you do is brand new, it's like you are doing the things that this person's soul knows is familiar to them, okay? In the physical, this person, this is new to this person, but this to this person's soul this ain't nothing new okay you're you're sparking this person's gifts or like you're awakening this person's gifts that were dormant inside of them that stagnant energy that was being held within their cells is being released this person is going to become more creative they're going to become more ambitious if this is a masculine they're going to become stronger mentally okay be able to decipher okay be able to say no okay to temptation here okay with the second house yeah this person is establishing their values and you are high on that list okay focuses on material and physical possessions finances self-worth personal values this person is becoming a high value individual with the magician here and it's like you are single-handedly ushering you could be a, some type of shaman energy but you are single-handedly ushering um this person into divinity okay and i'm hearing you're you could be grooming this person into divinity here okay because you know how i'm not even gonna get into that but yeah this person could have been manipulated all their life okay in their childhood okay or they could have just had a small per perception used to think certain things that they are realizing now is not serving them for the new life that they are entering in yeah, fourth house. It's like this person is building a home, a sacred space within themselves, okay? It's like they are pri prioritizing their peace here. They are prioritizing their peace. They no longer go after thrills. It's like they no longer act without thinking. They no longer jump without thinking here, okay? Yeah, magician coming out again. This person is tapped in, tuned in, and turned on. Okay, connection between spiritual and material. This person is very powerful and they have a lot of ideas or you can have a lot of ideas and y'all are going to partner up. Y'all are going to co-create. It's like you're going to be visualizing and they're going to be taking the inspired action or it's like in simpler terms, you're going to want to build something, fix something. And it's like this person has all the tools. And I'm thinking about <laughs> the other day I was with my twin and we had to go to his friend's house because he got stuck putting this bar together. And, you know, that's kind of the downfall when you are with a, a divine masculine or that's a downfall when you when you have a handy man, you know, because it's like everybody be needing him. <laughs> So it's something here where it's like your person, even if this is a feminine, they are going to be everyone's go to in a healthy way. OK, or it's like they just bring something to the table. They bring a skill set to the table that is like just so necessary in so many people's lives. And it was just so funny because his friend was like, bro, I feel so stupid because as soon as we got there, my twin had it like had it finished in like 20 minutes. <laughs> 
So it's like your person is going to be a Mrs. or Mr. Make it happen. It's like it's only right because that's the energy that you're in. It's like there's nothing off limits for you. OK, there's nothing off limits for you. Yes. I cannot make this up, y'all. Sri Yantra. OK, this symbol represents the union of the divine masculine and divine feminine. For some of y'all, you are in union with your God ordained person. <laughs> world here y'all are about to start a brand new cycle you are in union with your god ordained person okay and for some of y'all things are shifting in your life things are moving in your life um rapidly okay these could even be harsh changes because this is the path that you're about to be put on okay this is the path that you are about to be put on Anything else, Spirit? Hold on, let me get some love messages on this. I'm going to do the 18 plus on this reading. I am going to do the 18 plus on this reading. You are in union with your divine person. Your God-ordained person. You are in union with your God-ordained person. So tell me more, Spirit. Tell me more. What is going on? What is going on? Yes, this person feels like they need you in their life, especially with new beginnings coming after that. I'm getting if you resonate with this reading, you're going to resonate with the um, this person knows their purpose is tied into this connection. OK, yeah. Yeah, this person can want to take you out. Yes, for some of you, you are in union with this person, but it's unspoken. Yeah, twin flame signs. Both of y'all are receiving um, synchronicity signs at this time, but you're not sure that this person feels the same way as you do or something of the nature. And this is confirmation. Oh my gosh, twin flame signs just popped out again. And with the signs card. So when I say the signs are signing right now, okay. The synchronicities are synchronizing right now. They're like, you cannot deny. <laughs> you cannot deny. And we have hold me. So your person could be a cuddle dud. Oh my gosh. We have blessed ending the reading. And on this card, she is pregnant. So some of y'all are really going to be pregnant before the end of this year. And I'm going to go ahead and close this out and go into the next download that I have that I have been putting off, but clearly it has to come out. Okay. <laughs> Ciao.